Okay, so we got a quick little demo set up here now. Got our control board. RS-232 converter, power supply. And 4D systems touch panel. So, uh, I'm cleaning up the code on this. Kind of hoping some people out there will be able to give me a hand with this. So, just going to show you what we got. It's going to hook up the power. So, the little screen on here now, and I've just been playing with the touch panel. Um, it's just a little uh, start-up screen, just until the controller has stabilized, as we can see there. So I can go ahead now and actually touch this, and it'll enable the data. So we can see we have our controller data now. And I've uh, essentially cleaned up all of the um, display here. You can see I've got a little uh, 10K NTC on there now for the temperature sensing. And we've got the temperature dis displaying uh, degrees centigrade. So if I put my finger to that little sensor there, so you see it going up. Oh no, I'm clinically dead. Oh well. So I can twist the throttle pot there as well and be able to see the data scroll. And if I twist back, it'll see it'll clear it'll clear the data here and instead of having artifacts uh, still on the, the screen from the previous um, code. And I've also, <coughs> you can see here we have a motor RPM um, set up here too, so we can actually, the current firmware can actually monitor RPM and we can display that. So uh, it's just, just a little update on the uh, display system. And um, hope to get some um, analog type gauges. Uh, operating on this. I have to say that this, uh, this um, isn't the easiest type of a system to get to grips with. It uh, takes a bit of playing and it's not the most supported system it would seem either but so far so good. Okay, that's it for now.